that children aren't falling behind, um, provide help. We already have t way too many small businesses that are closing. We need to provide help to get them to the other side. And we've already seen 1.3 million state and local government workers, first responders, policemen, firemen, who've lost their jobs, and we need to get them back on the payroll. Um, and w people are on the verge of uh, losing the roofs over their heads. Um, the package provides rental assistance. Um, we have 24 million adults and 12 million children that are, are going hungry every day, and we need to provide them with food. Um, we have people suffering particularly. Hey folks, how are you guys doing so far? Are you excited for a third stimulus check? If so tell me down in the comments, how you plan on using these stimulus checks. Personally folks, I really think that President Biden and the Democrats, might approve the bill. Because that is the only way for them to gain, bipartisan support for the stimulus. Now guys, should our stimulus checks be $1,400 or $2,000? I just created this stimulus news channel to inform everyone about the very important stimulus check information. So it would mean a lot to me if guys could subscribe to my channel and click the bell. It really helps with the YouTube algorithm. Now folks, progressives like Representative Alexandria Ocasio-Cortez, are calling for Americans to receive $2,000 stimulus checks, as opposed to $1,400 checks, while Senator Bernie Sanders, is blasting the idea of narrowing the income requirement for check recipients. Ocasio-Cortez criticized her fellow lawmakers who are referring to $2,000 checks by adding together the $600 per person sent out under former President Donald Trump and President Biden's $1.400 per person proposal. In addition, Sanders, the new chairman of the Senate Budget Committee, didn't push back against Biden's $1,400 check proposal but did insist that individuals making $75.000 and under remain eligible for assistance during an appearance on State of the Union. We said we're going to get you $2,000, which is $600 plus $1,400, and what we're going to do is say that everybody, a single person, individual, $75,000 or lower, and a couple of $150, oh, 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 or lower will be eligible for the $2,000, $600 plus $1,400, Sanders said on Sunday. Also, to say to a worker in Vermont or California or any place else that if you're making $52,000 a year, you are too rich to get this help, the full benefit, I think that that's absurd, and it's also, from a political point of view, a little bit absurd that you would have, under Trump, these folks getting the benefit. But under Biden, who is fighting hard for the working class of this country, they would not get that full benefit," Sanders continued. Biden is reportedly open to compromising on the structure of stimulus checks in his proposed $1.9 trillion coronavirus relief package. He told House Democrats on Wednesday that he is open to modifying the adjusted gross income thresholds for an additional round of direct payments, but he is holding steadfast to the $1. 400 check amounts, according to Politico. Progressive Democrats continue to criticize the $1,400 payments. Treasury Secretary Janet Yellen said Sunday that she thought income levels identified by conservative Democratic senators to restrict which Americans receive direct payments under the Biden administration's aid package were too low. Speaking with CNN's Jake Tapper on State of the Union. Yellen indicated that she thought individual Americans earning $60,000 per year ought to be eligible for the direct payments, a higher figure than the one identified by senators such as Joe Manchin, who has called for the payments to phase out at the $50,000 per year income level. If you think about an elementary school teacher or a policeman making $60,000 a year and faced with children who are out of school and people who may have had to withdraw from the labor force in order to take care of them and many extra burdens, President Biden, thinks, and I would certainly agree, that it's appropriate for people there to get support, said Yellen. That is all of the news in this video. Thanks for all of your support. I truly appreciate it. Be sure to subscribe to my channel and click the bell. Thank a lot.